Hey, hello, we're going to do a review about two Mets books. Two Mets books, nine packs. Normally I don't buy them, but I was triggered by this exclusive. This one that I still haven't found in a single pack. The Fiat 500, also cool looking. This one right here. Still need to find that chase, but that's uh, impossible, I'm afraid. Uh, also a cool exclusive and this BMW right here. What's that? That ugly thing is also inside this Matchbox 9-pack. <sighs> from all the cars from... Uh, what was it? What was it? I have it here. Right here. No, not. I have it here. City Adventure 3. And from all these cars, they choose this one to be in the 9-pack. My god. Okay. Um, we're going to have a look at this one right here first. So how are we going to open it? We're going to open it here from the side. Yes. Is there any more information on the back? That's maybe interesting for you. Freeze the frame if you want to read it. Yeah. Barcode article number. Licensed product. That's a good thing. That is what we like. Okay. That one we do over there. And we start with this fire truck. A little bit closer to the light. Fire and EMS, Matchbox Rescue. Now, if you like fire trucks, you definitely have to follow Red Trucks, Trucks T R U X, because he has a channel with a lot of diecast fire trucks. And I will leave a link uh, to the channel in the description. Okay, then, this uber cool Fiat 500, I like this one a lot, we got full deco I believe, yes we do, and that is very nice, very cool casting, I also like the blue color, we have side windows, and we even have pretty good steering wheel, not bad at all. And we have this one right here. This is the Ford Interceptor Utility. Yeah, I like this casting American flag on the side. That's always a good thing. Painted front lights. We got a big bull bar in the front. Nice wheels. We got a tow bar. Painted rear lights. For the alarm lights on top. How about a steering wheel? No, steering wheel in this one is not that good. And if you look at this one, if you look from the top, I'm not sure if you can see it that good. Let's go a little bit here to the light and zoom in a little bit more. Here, the steering wheel is a stomp. That is so disappointing. Okay, let's go to this one. A hot rod. Also pretty cool looking. I like the color combination. Steering wheel, total disaster. Uh, nice wheels. Here we got the base. Black base. Plastic base, 1935 Ford, made in Thailand. Got a box here in the back, in the trunk. Yeah, pretty cool. Here we get another rescue vehicle. Not my thing, to be honest, search and rescue.
step base, snow treasure. And then we got the mini. Painted front lights. Blacked out windows. It's probably a mini from a VIP. Full deco, I like that. Typical Metzbox rims. Here we get a gray base. Then we have the Ford Police Interceptor. I think it's pretty cool that there is a Metzbox logo here in the back. Hazmat team. Fire department. Again, blacked out windows. Hmm. Oh no. Well, they're pretty dark, but they're not blacked out because I can see the interior through it. It's a little bit too difficult to see on the camera, but we do have an interior. Okay, then the most favorite casting from this 9-pack, the Opel Cadet Coupe. Yeah, it's uh, very nice, very well done. Black interior, white and yellow colors, GTE. It's a little bit of dust on it already. Check this out. Nice deco here on the back. Painted rear lights. License plate. I like that. Very cool car. Beauty. And then the exclusive. An ambulance. A Renault. Painted front lights. Servizio. Urgenza, Emergenza, blue windows. Uh, we got an interior in the back. All kinds of ambulance things. Yeah, not a bad casting. I like this one. Good ambulance. Oh, we have a metal base. Yeah, there is so much plastic here. And then you get a metal base. What does it say? Renault Master Ambulance. Okay, now let's have a look at the other nine pack. So, yeah, let's open it. Mm. Here on the side. Oh. There we go. Dutch D200, I believe. Yep, Dutch D200. Pretty cool in this uh, Mets Box Motorsports livery. I think it's a tough looking casting. I think I also have the black version and the first uh, one that came out. Also have that one, yeah. Pretty cool looking. Uh, not a big fan of this Jeep, but it is pretty cool and realistic looking. I like that it has uh, painted rear lights. License plate with Jeep, four by four. It's pretty complete. Side mirrors.
then this one right here what was the name again Malibu Marauder yeah. what is this right here some sort of bodyboard or something I don't know no yeah. Then we have the BMW 3 Series Touring. Yeah, that's a nice one. Black rims, black paint, painted front lights and rear lights and a license plate. Yeah, that is definitely a winner. Not sure. Oh, Touring. Touring, the license plate wagon. But uh, yeah, the steering wheel is a disaster. Interior looks good, nice sunroof. Ah, nice paint by the way. Yeah. Very cool. Then we have another hot rod right here. We got Ford Coupe 1933. Here we got the Chrysler 300. Nice blue paint, side mirrors, steering wheel, uh, doesn't look okay, but it's better than a stump. Painted front lights, painted rear lights, Chrysler logo in the middle, uh, painted brake light, some windscreen wipers, oh, got some scratches on the window, yep. This is a cool one. I like this one. Interior looks okay. Nice spare wheel here in the back. Also black, same as here. Got some side mirrors. Yeah, painted rear lights. And here we have the base. Very nice looking casting. We got the Audi. The nice red pink color. I like the black paint here on the grill. Audi TT RS made in Thailand. Yeah, pretty cool looking. And the exclusive, a nice Ford Mustang. A gray color with black rims. Yep, that's what I like. Ford Mustang GT. Side mirrors, nice hood, painted front lights. Yeah, this is a cool looking exclusive. Very well done. Maybe we can uh, put a figure inside. Whoa. Got uh, the zombie chick right here without the legs. Oh. There she is. Let's go over here and let's see if we can put you in this exclusive. Here we go. It's possible for you. Ah. Okay, let's try it again one more time. Okay. 
let's use a knife i advise you do not use a knife because you can damage the figure i believe it doesn't fit no? okay let's try it one more time but i believe this sun blocker is also blocking the figure from ah there she goes there it is yep hands on the steering wheel looks pretty good huh zombie chick in their new matchbox exclusive convertible okay well thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already share this video with your diecast friends and i will see you next time have a very nice day bye